want to throw this in. The Quran is unlike any other book. Wallahi, I've read almost most of the major religious books. I'm almost graduate on those books. The Bhagavad Gita, the Purana Vedas, the Old Testament, the New Testament, the Bahia books and the Quran and the Bible. I have studied them for more than 20, 35 years. I'm doing this research. And so each and every book, including my book and the book that you wrote, it begins with story. Once upon a time. My name is in my book. My, in the beginning, uh, my name is Muhammad Awal. I was born in Nigeria. I went to University of this. That's how you start, you start your story. Your biography. My name is Sheikh Abu Bakr, and I was born in here, and I went to this Azahar University, and I did this. That's how we begin. Each and every book, the Bhagavad Gita, the same. The Bible begin. In the beginning, God created in the beginning. It's like a story, once upon a time. Each and every book. Look at the Quran. Look how Allah revealed the Quran. It's not once upon a time story. Iqra'a. Read. No story of uh, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Rasulullah. There is not mention of any of his family in the Quran. That's a different book. How come in the Quran, Muhammad, his mother, not mentioned in the Quran? What kind of book is this? How come in the Quran, his father not mentioned? Abu Bakr, close friend in the cave. Why is his name not nothing mentioned about him? Explicit, maybe implicit, some ayah will refer to him, but explicit, no. Hadijah al Kubra, she should be in the Quran, she must. How come she's not in the Quran? Why? What kind of book is this? It's all like books. Muhammad removed himself out. His mother, his father, Aisha, not even mentioned once. Fatima, not mentioned. Abu Bakr, what kind of... Look, if Muhammad wrote the Quran, he will mention Abu Bakr. And Umar and Uthman, he must mention them. Because that's it's, it's natural. But how come? Look, it's a commandment from Allah. Read, it's a commandment. So we have the hadith. Why? When the Muhammad Sallallahu was in the cave, Gari Hira, and he said, Ikra, Muhammad Ma'ana Bikari. Ikra. Which man? The Quran didn't say Ma'ana Bikari. So the Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi he explained to us the verses. Muhammad said, Well, I was in the Gari Hira, and I was resting and thinking and contemplating, and the angel came and said to me, Ikra, why is it that those words are not in the Quran? Because it belongs to Muhammad, not for Allah. Simple and short. Allah's word is Allah's word. And I'm different. You can't touch it. Muhammad's word, different. The Sahabi's words, different. History, Sira, everybody different. We have Imam Ghazali, Imam this, Imam that, different books. But the Christian, they put all in the Bible. Summa yakuluna khazamin in the law.